grouping symbols. First thing you need to know is the notation. The brackets are open when the two ends are facing to the right and they are closed when the two end points are facing to the left. To simplify multiple grouping symbols, you want to start by simplifying from the inside of the parentheses that open and close on itself, meaning there is no other sets of parentheses inside of them. And then you just need to follow order of operations. In example number one, we have to simplify this expression. And if you notice, this parentheses is the one that opens and closes on itself. So the first thing to check if there is anything inside to be simplified, and x and y are not like terms, so we just need to proceed to the next step, which would be the distribution of this negative 4. So the first thing to do is you want to copy the inside. We have positive x plus y, that's inside of the parentheses. We have to distribute a negative, so we want to put it inside of the parentheses. So we have negative 4, negative 4. Now you want to keep everything that you have not used as is. So we have this bracket, 6, bracket 3. So now we have 3, bracket 6, positive times negative, negative, or x positive times negative negative or y close the parentheses now we want to see if there is anything to simplify and 6 4x and 4y are all different terms so we leave them as is and now we just need to distribute this 3 so we have 6 minus 4x minus 4y and Let's distribute this 3 times 3, times 3, times 3. This is the distribution step. All that's left is to simplify. 3 times 6, 18, minus 3 times 4, 12, x, minus 3 times 4, 12, y. All different terms, so that's our answer. In example number 2, we seem to have two sets of parentheses that open and close in itself, and it's fine, because we can simplify them separately as we go. So for the first parentheses, we have to distribute negative 1, and for the second parentheses, we want to distribute positive 1. So we want to keep everything else as is, so we have negative 2, bracket 3a, plus b times negative 1, plus 4c times negative 1, plus d times 1, minus 3e times 1. Close the parentheses. Let's simplify signs. So we have negative 2, 3a, positive times negative, negative 1 times b, b positive times negative, negative, 4c, 1 times d is just a d, 1 times 3 is negative 3, e. Before we move on, we need to check if we have any like terms. If we have a, b, c, d, e, everything is different. So we proceed with distributing this negative 2. We have 3a minus b minus 4c minus 3e. 2 is negative, so we want it inside of the parentheses, and we distribute negative 2. This is the distribution step. So we have negative 2 times positive 3, negative 6a, negative, negative, positive 2b, negative, negative, positive 8c, negative, negative, positive 6 E, all terms are different, so that's our answer. In the third example, we have two sets of parentheses. This parentheses open and close on itself, and this one. So let's simplify those first. So we have 5 bracket 3x 
we need to copy the inside as is y plus w we want to distribute negative 1 keep everything else as is distribute this 2 so this is distribution into two separate sets of parentheses that open and close on themselves so let's simplify positive times negative negative 1y which is y positive times negative negative w 2 times 3 we have 6y 2 times 2 we have 4w now we want to check if we have like terms inside of each of the parentheses and we do not so let's do distribution first parentheses has 3x minus y minus w and we need to distribute 5 so times 5 times 5 times 5 second parenthesis has plus 2x plus 6y plus 4w and we need to distribute negative 3 it's negative so we're going to put it in parentheses negative 3 negative 3 negative 3 now we have some simplifying to do so 5 times 3 15 x minus 5y minus 5w positive times negative negative 3 times 2 6x positive times negative negative 3 times 6 18y positive times negative negative 3 times 4 12w Okay, so now we have some like terms here. We have x here and here. 15, negative 6. Separate with pluses because we don't know what the final answer is. We don't want to be committed. And now we have some y's. We have negative 5 there. Negative 18 over there. And w's. So we have negative 5, negative 5. 15 minus 6, 9x. Negative 5, negative 18, same sign. We look for sum, and it's going to be negative sum of 23y. Negative 5, negative 12, same sign. We're going to have sum. We have negative sum of 5 and 12, which is negative 17 of w different terms so that's our answer so in example number four we have this parenthesis open and close on itself and we will be distributing a negative one so we have plus 2x because 2 was positive minus 1 let's distribute this negative one and we're going to keep everything else as is Let's simplify before we move on. So we have negative 2, 7x minus 3x, positive times negative, negative, 1 times 2, 2x, negative times negative, positive, 1, close the parentheses. We still have like terms here, so it's a x, 1 minus 2, everything else as is 1 minus 2 gives us negative 1x plus 1 we just did simplifying for first distribution now we have another parenthesis to, to distribute into so we have negative x plus 1 we want to distribute this negative 3 and to keep everything else as is let's simplify negative times negative positive 3x positive times negative negative 3 we have like terms 10x minus 3 and last but not least distribution so we have 10x minus 3 negative 2 negative 2 and we get negative 2 times 10 negative 20x negative times negative positive 2 times 3 6 
And that's our answer. That's all.